Hello, for today's video I'm going to be showing you guys how I cover my Petco Rat Manners levels with towels. And I'll just kind of show you what you'll need. What I use is five hand towels and four um, washcloths. And then I also, for if you want to cover up the stairways, I will use three socks. And the socks that I get are these kind, so they're a little bit of a longer of an ankle, but those really work the best. And I'll show you how I add those to the stairways too. And then you'll also need banana clips. Now, depending on the amount of banana clips you use in the cage, it varies depending on if your rat likes to pull up the towels at all. Um, but what I use is I use I use six banana clips in my cage, but you may need to use more. But I will show you the guys that. So I did already start putting some towels in the cage, so the video would be a little bit shorter. But at the bottom, just because it was harder to film, I do have two hand towels down there. Now you can use either two hand towels or you can use a smaller um, bath towel. But the reason why I use two is because when you put the first one in, there will be about this much that's not covered. So I just put that on top of that other one so it covers the whole thing. And I don't really think you can see it because I use gray towels down there, but that's what I do with that one. And then this level here, um, I already have one washcloth on there because the washcloths aren't long enough, so you have to use two. But I'll show you guys how I add that. So I'm going to take this washcloth here, and I will fold it about this much. And you'll just have to kind of eyeball it too until you know how much to fold it, and then I'll put that in the cage. And then just kind of fix it so it fits in there right, and then I will add two banana clips here. And just I always banana clip them on because in case they don't, they jump up there so they won't slide off. So I will put one at the corner here. And then I'll also do one covering both the two. And that is how I do my first level. And then coming up to this level here, I do the washcloths first. So I already have one on here, so it's kind of the same thing at the one bottom down there. But I'll put the washcloth on this side. So again, you're just going to fold it about this much, and then add that to the cage. And then, I already banana clipped that side, but I'm going to banana clip this side, so it stays on. And then I'm going to take my other hand towel and put along the rest of the cage. And it might be a little bit harder to show up but I will fold the, this hand towel about this much just so it doesn't, so it fits better on there. So I'll put that in the cage. And it fits pretty good. I need to smooth it out a little bit. But depending on where you put things in your cage is depending on how you're going to want to um, set up the towels in there. You can pull it to make it even. I'll show you guys. You can pull this part right here to make it even, but because I put a food dish here, I will pull this side a little bit more, and then I just tuck it in, and I will tuck in this stuff too, just to make it more smoother. And then over here, sorry if it's hard to see, um, but I'm just going to do the same thing. I'm just going to get in here and tuck it in. Now, depending on if your rat likes to pull up the towels, you can take banana clips right along here and clip them on. My rat's not interested in that, so I don't do that. But then I'm just going to put a, the, I have some extra here. So I just fold it over like this, and I put my food do, dish right on top of it. And then just kind of tuck that in again. And then I'll just put his treat dish in there, and then his water dish. You can hardly even know that you have to tuck that, but that's why I have that side. Um, like that, and then this side I just leave a little bit extra just so it kind of holds together better. But you can kind of play around and see how you want to do that. 
And then at this top shelf here is where I have his house. So because he sleeps up there, I want it to be a little more comfier for him when he sleeps. So I will use another hand towel. You can use washcloths up there if you want to. But I think this is just a little bit more comfier for them to sleep on. So when putting the hand towel up there, let's get it folded first. You guys are going to want to fold it about that much. It's kind of hard to see, I'm sorry. But, and then put, we'll put that right up here. And then I did do it a little bit longer. You can kind of see, so I'm just going to go ahead and fix that. But you just have to kind of eyeball it and see how to fold. But honestly, I think it's so easy to use towels in this cage. They fit so nicely. And then just make sure you smooth it out really good to make sure there's no creases on there. Um, just so your rat doesn't get any pressure sores or anything like that from sleeping. And then I'm just going to banana clip that on also. And I used two banana clips to try to make you guys see this. So I'm just going to banana clip it on. And then, because my rat sleeps up here, if he was to ever chew the towels, which I don't want him to, but he never does, I will put just a baby washcloth right up here. So, if he is tempted to chew it, he'll chew the washcloth first. So it kind of protects the towel a little bit more. So I do that, and then his house goes up here. Let's put that in. And then that is how I add all of my towels to my cage. So it's really simple. I'm hoping this video got, helped you guys out a little bit to know how to put towels in the cage and they really um, work great in the cage. So now I'm just gonna show you guys how um, I add my stairways. And when I'm doing this, like I said again, you'll just take a longer ankle sock. And then you find, this is the top because there's little loops to stay on. So this is going to be the bottom. So you're going to start off with the bottom and with the heel of the sock, put that on the back. So it's not in the front of your cage or your stairway. And then you're just going to basically slide your sock up. Sorry, I'm not doing this on camera. It can be a little tricky sometimes. But, and then you just pull it all the way up, and then you are left with this little bit, and what's really nice that you can do is you take this, and then you just kind of tuck it under like, like this, and then just kind of smooth it out, and that's what gives you the nice clean look of that. So this is a very great option to, to still use the stairways that they give you, and it just makes the cage look cuter, so I'll just put those in really quick. I'll put one in really quick for you guys. There. So I hope you this, got, this video helped you guys out a little bit on how I put the towels in my cage. And thank you guys so much for watching and please subscribe.